Yee-haw! Welcome back to the Southern Snack, where life is too short to be serious. All right, let's get this show on the road. We're at Sonic trying their new winter items. You've got a new uh, queso smasher burger, which has tortilla strips, jalapenos, onion, queso. You know how that rolls. And then you've got two new sodas. you got a sparkling sugar cookie Dr. Pepper and a buttery brew, which is a butterscotch... Um, Butterscotch root beer with sweet cream. And then my most, the most exciting item to me is the red velvet shake. So we're gonna go ahead and attempt to pose for this thumbnail. I think I think we should be able to work it out uh, just as long as my hands ain't slipping everywhere. But I mean, it's mostly just soda cups and um, a burger and a red velvet shake. So yeah, they, we're, we're closing in on it. There you go. All right. So I guess we'll start with the burger and then move on to the drinks. Uh, but let's let's take a look at this burger. We got a little bit of root velvet on there somehow. Yeah. So you can either do double or triple. And this is their, supposed to be their smasher patty. But this is a small bun. Uh, not used to them being this small. But it does look like it's smashed. So I've had the smasher patty twice. First time I just thought it was not good. Second time it was a little bit better. But I was not impressed. I don't know. I love smash burgers. I love a fresh beef patty. But Sonic is just not good to me. I know that their premium burgers though. Tend to be good. So we'll see. We'll give this one a chance. See how good it tastes. Let's go. Mmm. First thing that's clear, heavy on queso flavor. That's that's something that really highlights this. Very good, very solid. Nice uh, twang of the jalapeno, a little bit of a kick from that. It's not like crazy. It's not the most amazing queso burger you're gonna have again. You have to either deal with two stacks or three stacks of that beef that Sonic has. And to me, and their beef's not impressive, but I like what they've got going on with this. Nice little crunch, nice queso, melty flavor, and you got a little bit of jalapeno, as you can see. I'm going to give it 8 out of 10. All right, so red velvet cake shake. Let's move on to that next. There she is. It's a uh, red velvet cake batter flavor, and uh, I'm excited to try it. Mm. Rich notes of cocoa. Of course, the cake batter flavor is there too. Very solid. I think the only thing that could make it better add some actual like red velvet cake pieces into it. But aside from that, like really good flavor. Really nice aesthetics with the color and uh, very rich shake. Eight and a half. All right. So one of these is buttery brew. The other is uh, Dr. Pepper sugar cookie. They both have sweet cream, but of course the difference is, is the, the one's got butterscotch and one's got sugar cookie, one's got root beer, and one has Dr. Pepper. So let's try this, see what we got. This one's the Dr. Pepper. Very dope, very bold amount of Dr. Pepper. A little bit of that uh, sugar cookie notes. It's nice. It's it's really nice. It is almost like drinking a Christmas Dr. Pepper. Hmm. 
yeah I, I like this a lot it's very interesting it's like a creamy cream cream soda dr pepper with that sugar cookie twist a little bit of like a buttery note to it i'm gonna give it a nine i just want a little bit more sugar cookie there but it, it's a vibe it's a vibe all right let's end this review off hopefully on a positive note i mean pretty much so far we've had nothing but positive notes but uh you never know so this is buttery brew it's a uh, butterscotch uh root beer i keep forgetting this root beer but i don't know why not the biggest root beer guy but we'll settle it's not super different from dr pepper um of course, you got more of like a, a little bit more like a toasted caramel note there. But again, you get some similar elements to what you get with sugar cookie. Of course, root beer is a less, I, get, I would say, less aggressive family member to Dr. Pepper, right? Dr. Pepper's got more kind of things going on. But buttery brew, a little, little bit more kickback on the elements you get in there. And then I think it's got a little bit more richer tone. I really enjoy this. Personally, I think I like it more than the Dr. Pepper. Don't know, it's just the more the more rich flavor from that butterscotch. And it's it's having that opportunity to take over a little bit more than the sugar cookie Dr. Pepper. But I'm gonna give it a 10. Um, very solid lineup. Maybe makes your choice hard. But hey, there, there's nothing wrong with having a, a hard choice or you could try all four items up to you but that's all i've really got to say other than that i'll see y'all around